In this training video, we're going to look at linking text boxes to task within Microsoft Project. So I've selected a task, task 14. On the Format tab, we can use a text box under the Drawing sections of the ribbon. And I can choose a text box. And I can now draw a text box. And I can say, for example, induction must include HR induction must include and I'll just put Welcome pack. And company presentation. So I'll extend the text box a little bit. Now the text box has the information that I now want. And if I right click it and the font, I can now change the font size if I wanted to or the color. So I'll just make it And color blue and you can also do other things in a right click another one is properties so this is the big one so font properties now under properties I can put a fill against it if I wanted to custom put a different color against it Shows you the preview here. Now you can also link it because if the tasks move around, say that this task was um, constraint and we move it on a bit, you want the tasks, you want the task box to go with the task if it moves. So I want to go to size and position and I want to attach it and attach it to the you can go front point or back point. I've got the back point and I want to attach it to task 14, which is the HR induction. I click OK now. And I can move it around a bit. So I'm just going to move it to something like this. Now, if I put a constraint against task 14, I'd be wanting this box to move with it now because they need to be joined together. I don't want the task text box just to stay where it is. I want it to move with the task. So we'll just test this. I'll move it on a week of two weeks in this example. I'll go, the task is due in this example, 29th of July. I'll move it on a couple of weeks. So I'll constraint it. It's starting really then and I just want the date to go on two weeks. So here's the 29th of July. I'll just go forward one, two, to the 12th of August. Click OK. We can now see that the task is moving along. So as the, as the, as the constraint applies, the text box moves. If I give it a longer duration, if I set the constraint to December, for example, click 
Okay. You can now see the task has moved. But also the text box is going with it. So you can put little text messages or text boxes against tasks. And as the project moves, so does the text box with whatever information you want to add to it. We can now see how it's working. Here's the rest of the project. Task 14 is moving along and yet the, the box is still going with it, the text box. So this completes the training video on adding a text box to a project, attaching it to a task and also doing a bit, a bit of format into the text box. Here we did a bit of font colouring and a little bit of background colouring to the text box. But this completes the training video on using text boxes in amongst a project and linking them to tasks. If you enjoyed this video, make sure you like and subscribe to our channel. Hope to see you for the next tutorial and thanks for watching.